Let's revisit apple juice and see if arsenic levels have been mitigated. Um, the FDA just reported on July the 12th, 2013, that they will set levels of arsenic, permissible levels of arsenic in apple juice to 10 parts per billion, similar to drinking water. Um, a few months back, we tested a store-bought apple juice, found high levels um, in those apple juice and let's test again using the test safe arsenic detector and uh, here we have our chart to see the results let's proceed to test and see if uh, the levels of arsenic is now safer or less from store-bought apple juice let's begin the test safe arsenic detector comes in a tube like this we take out this pouch. I set the detector cap on tissue paper here, removing the filter paper. The detector pouch has a solution that needs to be placed on the detector cap and I'm going to cut that pouch with the solution in it and eyeball a drop into the detector uh, into the detector cap. Does it? You wait for that to dry for about two minutes. Once we start doing this, we have to use this detector within the next two hours, which we will do. Here's some apple juice. We need only to fill it to this level above here on the detector. Two minutes are up. We're going to pour the apple juice to the level here in the detector. Replace the filter paper. and screw the cap on. We're going to wait for 30 minutes. 30 minutes are up and it's time to check the results. This apple juice um, it says on the label is made with concentrate from the USA, Argentina and China. And let's proceed to uncover this detector cap and let's take a look. There's a slight discoloration and um, I estimate that the parts per billion of arsenic in this test is between 10 to 15, maybe slightly closer to 20. So a lot better than our results from before. 